O R I D A. What's that spell? Hurricane. Yeah, you guessed it. Hey guys, what's up? And welcome back to my channel. For those of you that are new here, my name is Kyra. I create content about my life and journey in general. And right now, that journey has me in Orlando for the Disney College program. I don't know if you guys have heard, um, but we're under Hurricane Watch. pretty like crazy and insane to think about um, but anyways I'm trying to make the best of it um, so I decided to vlog for the next couple of hours as I prepare for it um, because you never know someone could stumble upon this video and just think it's entertaining or it can be informational um, if you want to do the program and this happens during your time I don't know, but anyways, I thought it would be cool to vlog. Um, but yesterday was Tuesday, and we got further information about the hurricane. Um, so um, one of the options that I was able to have because I have been working in food and beverage um, was to do a ride out, which means basically we are helping and assisting guests during that time helping to prepare food, to do whatever, and to work um, until they call for shelter in place, and then we will shelter in place at our um, locations. So I'm thankful because the parks are closed for Wednesday and Thursday. Um, the hurricane is supposed to be gone by Friday, but you never know with the weather. Um, so as of right now, I will be not in the apartment but i will be at my actual like job location and um, if the weather worsens and we are not able to work we will be sheltering in place over there so i thought i would take you guys along with me while i get ready for doing that i have to pack a kind of just a go bag um, I'm taking my suitcase because it'll be easier and I want to be able to roll it and have to carry things um, especially because we won't be able to use elevators because of the storm um, and it just feels easier to I don't know basically got back here a whole hour after getting off so I got back here at 1:30. I think it's 2 a.m. right now um, and I have to report to work tomorrow by 12 so this will be exciting uh, definitely a interesting college program experience, but I can say that I assisted during a hurricane, so. Okay, I have you guys on my bed because, um, no, it's a great angle. Um, so I, they were told, we were told to bring like basic toiletries, things that, basically everything that we need to get through the next couple of days. Um, I'm gonna plug everything up charger wise and not unplug it until tomorrow. And then they also said to bring some chill clothes, um, pajamas, that type of thing. It's a big sleepover basically. Uh, so I'm gonna try to do that within the next 10 minutes, like pack and get everything done. And then I'm going to shower make a sandwich or get something to eat um, very small and then I'm going to pass out. It is 3.30 a.m. now. 
um, as you saw, I just made my sandwiches. Um, so I'm gonna sit in bed and eat those fairly quickly. Um, I've got my computer plugged up, but I think I'm gonna watch a show just to um, go to sleep too. And I will see you guys in the morning for the last bit of prep. I started a load of laundry because I realized that um, some parts of the uniform that I need are in the laundry and I just don't have multiples of those so I had to wash things um, and all of my like lounge clothes I've been wearing for the past week so I needed to do this but I think I did fairly good packing not too bad because um, I still have tons of space the only thing I'm questioning is if I need a pillow and a blanket because it says to bring one on the list but then I'm also like they're supposed to be housing us in rooms so, I don't know, but I'll do snacks and stuff in the morning. Um, my goal is to be up by 8.45 or 9 um, because the last bus that I need to take leaves here at 10.55. So, as long as I leave here by like 10.45, I should be good. So, that gives me two hours tops if I get up at 8.45. But, good night. Good night, guys. I will see you in a couple hours. <music> Thank you.